Jitters about the global economy are sparking concerns about that dreaded R word. We're talking recession. Here to explain what's behind all this recession talk, Mark Pearson, founder of the investment firm Nepsis. Welcome. It's good to have you here Thanks, today. Thanks, Pat. Glad to be here. Uh, give us a little backdrop on why people are feeling this fear. Well, I think, number one, the media is focusing on it. Mm. So you turn on the TV and it's negative. Everything is negative. The economy is slowing down. The tariff talks, uh, trade wars. Uh, interest rates, there's a host of different things that people are focused on. There are measures that I know economists look at, you know, in determining whether things are ripe for a uh, recession. Yes. And we have some Q&A. Let's do a true or false right Sounds now. Sounds good we'll to go me. Through for I got a 50-50 shot. You have a 50-50 <laughs> shot. And you do too at home. Let's start with the first one here. Uh, true or false, the recession will be here six to nine months. False. False. You and can't predict when you're going to get a recession. And that's that's the bottom line that on that. You can't predict. Line. All right. Once uh, unemployment hits seven percent, we're in a recession. True or false? With that's that? also false. And too what? too specific. There are a lot of variables that go into reasons why you have a recession, and unemployment is just one piece of it. But now there's a lot of others. Uh, number three. When it comes to a recession, it's not a question of if. It is a question of when. Correct. Everyone should expect a recession. Embrace it. Love it. Why? Because re recessions create volatility. Volatility creates opportunities to buy great businesses on sale. The average time frame of a recession is 11 years. Ironically, though, this is the longest economic expansion we've had in history right now. And to add to that, as people try to prognosticate, postulate, and speculate about a recession, look at Australia, Pat. They haven't had a recession in 28 years. 28? 28 years. Well, that speaks. Uh, the Probably the world's best known investor uh, is uh, Warren Buffett. What yes. does he say about I recession? I love Warren Buffett. Yeah. We, 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 uh, we try to, we try to uh, mimic him as much as possible. Warren Buffett, at 89 years old, recently said, I hope I see three more recessions in my lifetime. Why it's is that? Because he can buy businesses on sale. It's interesting. Everybody loves Warren Buffett, loves to hear what he says, but people don't follow what he says. It just makes them feel better. Smart people do. Smart though. people do. That yeah. is exactly right. So uh, recession, when it does occur, is an opportunity. That is Without when things question. are much cheaper and you can buy a lot of these stocks and do much better. Yes and no. Usually recessions are an after effect of the markets. In other words, markets actually move before recessions happen. Actually, mm. markets are up in recessionary periods. Our viewers are watching right now and they're saying, what should I be doing right now? Uh, what would you be telling people? There's two things I'd be, three things really I'd be th uh, focused on. Number one, I would make sure that my portfolio is allocated in a manner conducive to my tolerance for risk and volatility. Notice I say risk and volatility. We believe volatility is not risk. We believe that is opportunity. Number two, make sure you have your emergency reserves in place. We're always telling our clients, make sure you've got that money in the bank that if there's an emergency and unexpected expense, you have that money available to you so you can take advantage of it. And number three, most importantly, stick to the knitting. If you have a proven investment process, a buy discipline, sell discipline, stick to your proven process. Well, we appreciate the insights and the advice here today. Thank My you pleasure. for being appreciate here with it. us. You can find more information on uh, Care 11 app as the uh, as seen on TV section. Well, up next.